Hi there guys, it's the OSX Kid and we're doing a tutorial today on how to download films offline using the app Transmission. So what you're going to need for this app, uh, for this tutorial is the app Transmission. I'm going to put the link in the description below. And um, what this app is, is something that downloads torrent files off the internet. So you want to go into your search engine and I'm using Google Chrome just because I prefer that. What you want to type in is kickass torrents. And wait till that's a load. When you get on kickass torrents, it'll come up with a page looking like this. And from here, you can go into your search bar and search for any film you want. So, first one that comes to mind, Hot Fuzz. Oh. then it'll come up with this page. You want to scroll down and click on movies because that's what we want to download and scroll down again. Now it comes up with all these numbers, there's three things you want to look for. You want to look for the size of the file and the amount of cedars and leeches. So pretty much you want to find a file where it's got a low amount of size and a higher amount of cedars and it has leeches. And when you've found one, you can check the comments, see if it's a good download, see if it's a good film. And that just ensures you that it's going to be a safe download. And when you've chosen it, you want to click this arrow here and that downloads it. In Google Chrome, it comes up at the bottom. You can show that in Finder. And when you get on it, you can open that with transmission. This window will pop up and you can just click. Add. If that's a load. Sorry, it's here. And it'll come up like this. And what that's going to do is it's going to download that file for you. And then it's going to add it into your download files into Finder. And from there, you can just click it and play it. Uh, an app that I recommend to use to watch these videos because QuickTime Player doesn't always play them is VLC Player and I'll put a link in the description for that as well. That will play pretty much any multimedia thing that you throw at it. It will play anything. So yeah, and that's how you download files using Transmission. Hope you enjoyed the video guys and leave a like if you enjoyed it. Comment if you've got any problems and see you in the next video. Thanks guys.